Now, uh, checking question number 7 and 9. 7th one is a polynomial function. You can see uh, the domain is set of real numbers, even the codomain. And the function is defined as fx is equal to 3 minus 4x. So we have to again check whether it is 1, 1, n on 2 or not. So, taking any two elements from the domain, which is set of real numbers, such that their images are equal, we could see image of x1 will be 3 minus 4x1, image of x2 will be 3 minus 4x2, which on simplification gives us x1 is equal to x2. So, f is 1, 1. So, one condition is fulfilled. Let us check whether it is on 2 or not. So, we will take an arbitrary element in the set R, which is codomain, such that y is equal to 3 minus 4x. By assuming this, uh, we are implying that the element x is having image y. So, this is one ar uh, any arbitrary element in the codomain, which is image of some uh, element in the domain. So, if y is 3 minus 4x, then on solving, x comes out to be 3 minus y over 4. The nature of y is known to us and for that, y, we have to check is x an element of the domain or not. If yes, then the function becomes onto. Otherwise, it is not onto. So, you can quickly see the domain is r, the codomain is also r. So, if y belongs to the codomain, we should be able to show that it is image of some element in the domain which is also set of real numbers. So, we need to check the nature of x. If you see, look at the expression, the denominator is 4. It will never take an indeterminate form. Y will, if I replace y by 3, then x becomes 0. If I replace y by numbers less than 3, then x will take the uh, positive real value. If I take y greater than 3, then I will get negative real values for x. But in any case, x comes out to be a real number. So we can say for all y belonging to codomain, which is set of real number, there exists x which also belongs to the set of real numbers. That is why f is on 2. Therefore, now see because it is 1, 1 as well as on 2, it becomes a bijective function. Okay, then look at the ninth one. Here the function uh, is from the set of natural numbers to natural numbers and it is defined as n plus 1 by 2 if n is an odd natural number and n by 2 if n is an even natural number. Now you have to check whether it is bijective or not and you have to justify. Now when they say uh, you check whether it is bijective or not, you can quickly see if the very first condition is not fulfilled, that is, it is not 1, 1, then you can say it is not bijective and the work is done. So, if we go by the language given in the question which says, you check whether it is bijective or not and justify. So, you look at the question again carefully, see the first condition. You will quickly see it is n plus 1 by 2 and the nature of n is odd. So, when 1 is added to an odd natural number, the sum always becomes even and it can be divided by 2 also. Now, all the even numbers when divided by 2 may come out to be odd. They may come out to be even. Moving on to the next condition. Here, n is even. So, obviously, it is divisible by 2. Again, whatever even number it is, sum on getting divided by 2, we get odd natural numbers. For some, we get even natural number. So, you think. Can you think of uh, two different natural numbers for which the image comes out to be same? See, this is one such example. If I replace n by 1, then f1 will become 1 plus 1 by 2. This is the definition we have to use because n is odd. Okay, so 1 plus 1 by 2 is 2 by 2 which comes out to be 1. So, image of 1 is 1 only and on replacing n by 2, its image f2 comes out to be 2 by 2 which is 1. So, what do you see? 1 is having image 1, 2 is also having image 1. So, two different values for n having same images. So, we can say function is not 1, 1. And because we have shown it is not 1, 1, there is no need to check it is on 2 or not because we have to only tell whether it is bijective or not. So, we can come to the conclusion here itself that it is not bijective and justification is being done. Okay, so the simplification or explanation, it ends here only. 
but in case the question is put in a different manner and you are being asked check whether it is 1 1 and on to or not then you have to check both the conditions 1 1 we have shown it is not 1 1 we can check for on to so i have taken y an arbitrary element of the codomain such that y can be expressed as these two expressions depending upon n is odd or even so y will be n plus 1 by 2 if n is odd and y will be n by 2 if n is even. Now if this we simplify, then n comes out to be c in the first case, it will become twice of y minus 1. So one possible value of n will be 2y minus 1. And the other possible value will be twice of y. Nature of y is natural number. So what do you see? What all values small n is taking, small n will become and odd natural numbers from here you can easily see no matter whether y is even or it is odd 2y minus 1 comes out to be an odd natural number and again here no matter whether y is even or odd twice of y becomes even so you can see collectively i have written y belongs to n nowhere we have separately mentioned the nature of y even or odd whether it is even or it is odd in some of the cases n will become odd in other cases it will become even that means whichever natural number in the codomain you have taken you will be able to find some natural number in the domain for which it is image again you can see in the diagram see 1 is image of 1 and 2 then 2 is image of 3 and 4 3 is image of 5 and 6 in the same way 4 will be image of 7 as well as 8 and so on and you will find every natural number in the codomain is image to some element in the domain. So the function is on to but it is not 1 1. As I told you earlier you will check how the question is being put. Are they asking you to check both the things or they are only saying check whether it is bijective or not. When they say it is bijective or not you quickly show whether one condition is fulfilled or not. If it is not fulfilled there only we can come to the conclusion that it is not bijective. So go for checking both the things. If they ask, check whether it is 1, 1 and on 2 or not. If they are asking only for bijection, then you can stop here only.